Alright, so now the map opens into three different places. Um... I don't know. High Priestess, Empress, Emperor. Let's go, uh, let's go, uh, Emperor. I mean, there's really no reason to do any of them. Is that what the Emperor looks like? Yeah. Thieves have stolen- oh, we can actually read them, I guess, okay. Thieves have stolen a relic from the Emperor's palace. The Empire are looking to hire adventurers to help recover this and other items. Explorer, the road ahead is long, ensure you have enough food. Bandit Country, thieves, okay. And Pathfinder, use math re map reveal. Okay, what are the other ones like? It's interesting, you get a little, little insight. Earn fame in order to wield the legendary weapon, Threthas Ire. Villages on the northern outskirts are under assault from northern raiders. Uh, seek, defeat the mighty shaman who is leading their raids. Mighty hero, gain enough fame, and raids their northerners. Okay, alright. And... High Priestess. Collect blessings in order to enter the ritual house at the summit of Mount Freitas to negotiate a treaty with the northerners there. Tributes, gain blessings, northern armor, do not expect to be welcomed, and campfire. I don't know. I think I'm still gonna do Emperor, I guess. Why not? Encounters. Okay, we definitely want this. Uh, any of them with coins we want. Okay, the Market Thief. Is that? No, oh, wait, no. Which one was the one we got from... Oh, Malaclips's problem. Okay, so that's the one we fucked up, so we'll try that one again. We don't know what any of these give us, so we'll stick those in. Okay, we know what that one gives us. Don't need it. Uh, well, we got three spots left. Okay. Um, equipment? Sounds good. Equipment sounds good. Reveal map. Uh, actually, it did say to do that. Oh, look, it highlights at the top left if these match what you'll need for this map. Oh, that's, that's neat. Okay, well, if it says we need it. Uh... Damsel, arm wrestling. Yeah, arm wrestling. Why not? Maybe we'll get like round two of arm wrestling. Probably something a little stronger. Do we still have like just enough of these? Yes. Yep. What do they do though? No, we don't know. No idea. Okay. Oh, no, wait. Inspect. Got it. Unknown. Nope. I was right. You don't know. Don't know. Got it. Alright, let's go. These foes I place before you these rules. I do not know truly if they will train you for the challenges that Callus will place in your way. What's the moon? Of course, we know how this part of the story ends. The Emperor is merely the face on the throne. Behind him, the usurper pulls the strings. The one who sits upon the throne of life and death has a great influence upon the world. Their very soul permeates the lands and fills the hearts of the people. Hmm. The shrill voice of the town crier rings out across the market square. The Emperor himself seeks adventuring go Adventurers Guild members. Urgent expedition vital to the safety of the Empire. You spot a crowd of travelers weighed down with weapons and tools lingering nearby. The Emperor is offering a- The Empire is offering a reward just to set off on the expedition. Even more if we make it back. That's how desperate they are for help. Dealer adds a gold counter to the map. Oh. Oh, interesting. Okay. Gold. Oh, yeah. The Empire does not ask for much. But in the end, they take everything. On arriving at the gates of the royal palace, an armed escort leads you directly to the Emperor's chambers. The Emperor remains still and silent as his chief counsel lays out the expedition. Few relics from the last age still endure in this world. We had one in this very room until last night. She gestures to an empty pedestal. Not only must you reclaim the stolen symbol of our power, we ask that you gather its three sibling relics. Uh, who stole it? The evidence suggests a thief. <laughs> yeah, you don't the fuck you, you don't fucking say. Oh. Well, it was stolen, so I think maybe a thief stole it. Oh. They see it's on a weak spot in our guard's schedule. There are many treasures in the palace. It is curious that this is all they stole. Few relics from the last age still endure in this world. We had- oh, did you say the same thing? Examine the pedestal. 
An ornate pillow sits atop the stone pillar. In the dust, you make out the shape of a jagged blade. It was a ceremonial sword. It sat for decades under our protection. We're not protecting it, you understand. Hmm? We're protecting those who would try to possess it. Th then it wasn't under your protection, was it? The blade is cursed. Its venom strikes both wielder and foe in equal measure. If you... I mean, the same thing. Got it. Wait, so then why are you fucking worried? Hold, adventurer! It, take, it took skilled and dangerous thieves to steal the artifact. Art artifact. We need to ensure you'll be safe out there. See our training officer on the way out. What's with all the reading? This ain't no library. I've just, this is a card the game, man. I will notice that themes repeat themselves. Events, too. The wheel ever turns. You're greeted by Captain Estella Fiore. Fiore. Mm. Thieves are cowards at heart. They will dodge, dodge your heaviest attacks just as they dodge their civic duty. <laughs> a swift blade is best to defeat them. Here, try these out. dual wield weapons are effective against fast enemies like thieves, but are weak against armored enemies like Empire. Like Empire. Cutthroat's blades. I understood the duel. If you are at war, use every tool at your disposal. If not, let things lie. It's got th stun thieves. Perform six strikes that cause stunned thieves. Stunned enemy. Okay. Repost against thieves deals more and increases hits increased during a combo. Repost can counter can interrupt counterattacks. All right, I guess. Still, you find yourself hunting relics. Do you not wonder why or what they may do? Did I talk about my emote yet? No, I did not. That is something, yeah, if anybody's got any ideas, got an emote now, available, and uh, <laughs> gotta fucking find out what to do with it. Gotta make one. Because two people subscribe now, which is pretty uh, wild. But yeah, <laughs> you're not getting anything out of it. Subscribing for no reason. No emote, no nothing. Just the kindness of your hearts. And the loose looseness of your wallets. Your quest takes you far away from the city. Vast wildlands stretch out before you. Oh, hey, Selwyn. No CK2 today? I try and keep it a little, little diverse when we're playing. So, yeah, not, not today. Your companion reminds you of the Emperor's mission. One relic was stolen by brazen thieves. Another is in the clutches of a shady merchant. One is enshrined in a tiny northern village. As for the last, Malaclip shrugs. Who knows? Find the four relics, deliver them to the Empire safely. Wow, this is a big map. I like this already. This is this is a lot. Good. Your a gaping but low. Make your choices really, <laughs> carefully. Really encapsulates the channel. Yeah, that's that's somehow I don't I don't know if I could get away with that one. I don't <laughs> I don't I don't know the uh, I don't know the use case for that one either. The wilds are sometimes treacherous and harmful. Thanks. You pluck, it's it's a decent idea, though. You'd have to make it abstract, you know what I mean? You'd have to make it like, no, that's not a butthole. It's just a, uh, uh, it's just like a, it's an asterisk. You pluck some juicy wild berries from a thorn-covered thicket. The realization they are poisonous arrives far too late. Thanks for making my choices for me, game. I lose max life. Oh, yeah. Even peace hides steel within. The wilds are home to many a rebel, criminal, and beast. Happy merchant emote, hand rubbing emote. I like that. Ooh, I like. You think I could get away with that one? That's like. Mmm. I bet I could if it's just like the emote was just two hands. I like that. Or the old man from my icon, but with huge googly eyes. Musketeer, deadly at a distance, only the most skilled are recruited into musketry. Musketeers fire heavy attacks. Defend with a shield, else evade for your life. I don't have a shield. Shit. Uh, oh, fuck. Give me, give me the spell. Thanks. Okay. Oh, there are thieves here too. The Empire working with the thieves? Why oh, can you still block? Oh, I still block absolutely fine. This probably can't block against range attacks. Ooh. Okay. I'm 
I'm gonna admit it. I like the combat of this game. This is nice. I like it. It's won me over. You put, you throw yourself into a lot of enemies like this. It's, it gets it's pretty fun. A little challenging, especially when you're fucking not paying attention like that. Hand rubbing is genius. I, I like hand rubbing, and that's another one. I think like. I don't know, when I'm thinking about it, I'm trying to think of, like, emotes that would actually, you'd want to use. You know what I mean? Like, something happens in the game, you know, like, it's, it has to be a good reaction. I think hand rubbing comes up a lot. I mean, I've been called a Jew, like, probably, you know, 30 times since I've started streaming at least, you know, like, a couple times a night. So it comes up. Am I playing with a controller or a keyboard? Controller. I don't know if you you probably can play with a, with a ma with a mouse and keyboard, but it's definitely made for controller. With the battle resolved, you scavenge what you can from the remains. You gain two fame. Hmm. So right now I've got dual dual handed knives. So either one of these I would not be able to use with dual handed knives. You, you are a Jew. Thank you. I don't know. I don't know. I don't, they, yeah, okay. This coming from the... I, okay, alright. Hey. I guess I'll just fucking take this. Yeah, I, I guess. I probably won't even use it. Although I just equipped it. Switch out, please. I think that's a, that's a really good fucking idea, though. I'm gonna have to see what I can... Come up with for a moment to make hands. on your travels. Savor it. The wilds are welcoming. Their bounty plentiful. In the bed of the river, you find some discarded coins. <laughs> it is perfect right here. This would be a chance to uh, make some anti Semitic uh, emotes right there. A little hand rubbing going on right, right now. We're diving into a river to pick up loose coins. The wilds are home to many a rebel, criminal, and beast. Right. Um, oh, I can change inventory right now. Oh. I don't have a good one-handed weapon. But they are probably heavily armored, so I'll go with the axe. Yeah. That's a trapper? Frost Trapper. No! On the frozen plains, prey are few and far between. I'm not on the frozen plains, though, so I don't know why I'm mentioning this. The keen eyes of a trapper sees all. Trappers throw hunting traps that snare their targets. Use evade to avoid the traps and change move direction rapidly to break free. Evade the traps. Story of my life. <laughs> Block against an unblockable attack. Good job. Got hit because I was too busy with my little windmill down there. <laughs> looks pleasant. The distance looks nice. I want to go there. The inside of my hydro flask looks like it's covered in mold. Right. Uh, yeah, I know. We got, I gotta clean it. What are you doing looking at my stuff? Um, Winter's Bane, which is powerful against Northerners. But I like to equip it. Not right now. We can apparently switch out weapons whenever we get into a battle, so I guess I'll just... It doesn't really matter. We're getting rich! 65! Yet inattention leads to disaster. Not every inch of the wilderness is peaceful. You're telling me I plucked more poisonous berries from the same kind of bush? <laughs> Am I fucking retarded? <laughs> Why would I do that? It's the same bush. The 
There is little I can say that will stop an adventurer pilfering ancient artifacts. The village of Durnich is unremarkable, save for a tiny, near-forgotten shrine. Here you find another relic resting on a dusty altar. An old woman greets you. I see you are interested in our relic. Local legends tell of a time when a great hero will come to claim it. Until then, it remains here under our watch. Uh, yeah, that's me. The woman scoffs. You are not the hero we were promised. Though I do sense greatness within you, a spark of nobility. Return to us when your soul burns brightly. Leave the temple behind. I like how she says to come back when my soul burns brightly, but what she really means is come back when I've heard of you. The wilds are treacherous and harmful. Well, okay, you slip and lose your footing. Though relatively unharmed, the same cannot be said for the pack of travelers' rations that broke your fall. No food. Your supplies are exhausted. Unless you find some food, you will surely perish. Oh. You are Mandy starving oh. now. Every fresh encounter will cause you damage. Tread carefully. Great. High on a misty mountaintop, you discover a vicious-looking plant. Its gaping mouth looks more than cape... That word. Gaping. Looks more... <laughs> I... I cannot read the word gaping without just, like... I don't want to read that word, is what I'm saying here. More than capable of shredding you to pieces, but at its base you notice some unusual fruit. You know what I mean? Like, I don't know if it's just that, like, being on the internet has, like, destroyed me, but I read gaping and just, I... That's it. too many bad images. If you throw something, you may be able to distract the savage mouth, thus allowing you to steal from fruit. Like, has anyone, has anyone seen that picture, that, those advertisements of, uh, yeah, Goatsy, yeah, that, not that, but that's, that's one of those sort of things. But has anyone ever seen those ads that are, uh, back when I was fucking, I don't know, a child or something and didn't use Adblock? I don't know why I fucking remember this ad. But it was like, some woman's asshole gaping and she was like on the ground and someone like puts a little golf ball into her ass and it just goes right in because she's got such a gaping butthole because I remember that every day of my life and it, that image will not go away if you <laughs> Now it's back. Now I gotta. Now that's on my mind. If you throw something, you may be able to distract the savage mouth, thus allowing you to steal some fruit. And there was there was no sound. There was no sound to it. But when it you like see it and you can you hear the sound, even though it's a silent ad, you hear like the like the just drop right in. Mm. Uh, throw a piece of equipment. Yeah, we got shitty equipment. We don't need right. Oh, we gotta give him one of our good things. Give him the axe. We don't need two two hand shit. You know what I mean? We'll have one with a sword, one one with a shield, and one without a shield. That's good. Although, wait, why the fuck are we doing this? Wait. If you throw something, you may be able to distract it and steal some fruit. Oh, probably heal me or food. I actually really need food. Yeah, yeah. This makes a lot of sense. Throw the axe. Stop talking about this. I'm sorry. Gay as fuck. We tie as a woman's asshole. It's not like I was looking for it anyway. I mean, it was just there. You launch your warrior's axe at the creature. With a snap of its jaws, the item disappears. You pluck one of the fruits while it's distracted. The fruit is especially delicious, leaving you feeling fresh, refreshed, and vigorous. Oh, max health. And yeah, oh, that's, that's not bad. Uh, food would have been better, probably, but... The creature curls up to protect the remaining fruit as you leave the area. Let's try here. Uh, still starving. More enemies. Okay, we gotta be very careful now. Because we're we're pretty low. Maybe it wasn't a good idea to skip to the, the third place that we could. Probably there's a reason. What the fuck? Why did you equip this? Who told you to equip the shitty starter items? What the hell? Oh, great. Okay. Okay, no. Alright, we're fine. We're fine. Just 
dodge. There's no problem. Just stabbed him through the chest with a wooden sword. Good. No damage. It warned you to use a lot of food cards. Well, the thing was, we didn't have many... You're right. I mean, we... I didn't think it was going to be that big of a deal, is my excuse here. Also, we didn't have that much, like, that many choices with cards, but yeah, we definitely could have done better. Soldier sword. That's, that's something. We want to change, though. Seven food! Hey! All right. I have little Solve. sense of trust for wandering merchants. True bargains are rarely found with those who are unwilling to wait around for their customers to test their wares. We can just buy the relic. Uh, could we get a little better? If you win, the price will be reduced by the total of the die. If you lose, he may refuse to sell the relic to you. Dice target five. What, with three die? Should be easy, right? Yeah, I just gotta roll three twos and I've got it. Yeah, okay, done. Sweet. Relic price reduced by 11. Buy or negotiate? Oh, it goes up and up. Uh, how greedy do I want to be? I can always just kill him if I fuck up, so I guess we'll do one more. Dice, oh, I can, oh, okay, it tells you first, so. Dice target, 12. So that would be what? Four, four, four? Ah, uh, no, we'll just buy it. What a wandering merchant. I've only seen this much gold, this much coin in my dreams. The merchant seems pleased with the sale. Oh, no, he's just a shitty merchant. Cursed Helm of Ogaku. Cursed. The new wielder of this item will gain a curse. It cannot be discarded. Okay, don't put that on, please. Oh, no, you just get a curse automatically. Okay, good. Lose blessings. Lose one blessing after every combat in which you use a weapon ability or artifact. Well, I don't have any blessings, so the joke's on you, game. This relic is cursed, Mal Clips exclaims. Who'd want to steal such a thing in the first place? Dark side yeoman emote. What would that entail? <laughs> the wilds are home to many a rebel criminal. It's, yep, okay, this is good. More fights. Just now realized that it says in the bottom right exactly what you're gonna fight. It said anarchist and something else. I didn't read the other one, but. It's actually very useful. Like, maybe I should actually prepare for the right thing. Soldier's sword. Every hero must have a heroic sword by their side. This, however, is utterly ordinary. Then why show a fucking cutscene for it? So we're now at the level of fighting a boss as a normal enemy. I like that. I like when games do that. It's good progression. Also, he was easy as hell. Ah! Got out of the way and then went right back in. Otherwise, I think, yeah. With the battle resolved, you scavenge what you can from the remains. You gain two fame. 10 health. Good, good. We need some health back. Revealed three encounters. Oh. Treacherous Wilds, Treacherous Wilds, and Gnomes. Well, we kind of want to avoid the Wilds, I guess. Uh, so let's go to the... Let's head to the Gnomes. It's kind of the way I was going to go anyway. Although the Treacherous Wilds do give me fame, and I'd need fame to get the relic. We'll see. Oh, there's more Treacherous Wilds. Okay, that doesn't even fucking matter. Uh, I lost more food. Only one. Okay. This seems worth a buy. It's pretty interesting so far. I like it. And I mean, like, this is... Uh, it said there were 22 different things that we're going to, you know, for each of the Arcana of the Terra cards. So, like, we've gone through, like, what? This is the... S counting the... Not counting the tutorial. This is, like, the second level. And we're, like, an hour and a half in. So, I mean, that's pretty indicative of worthwhile so far. 
Malaclips is probably okay. We definitely need to go to the corner and get that problem. That's the thing we fucked up before. We want to get that. I like this. You just add more. <laughs> like I, I like the maps being bigger like this. It adds a lot more deciding where to go and strategy and stuff like that. You know. You arrive at a signpost detailing the possible paths east and west. Okay, we're gonna ignore this guy for a little bit and we'll loop back around, get some of those other encounters. Between my loathing or we could just go south and then avoid the and my despair wilds. that the world is becoming less strange and arcane as the Empire spreads. Yeah, maybe we'll just go south, run into him, and then go west from there and we'll go around the wilds by doing that. Yeah, that makes sense. Halt, vile humans, a voice calls out as from a as a dozen small creatures leap from the trees around you. It takes a moment to realize they are gnomes, dirty, poorly armed gnomes. A few hold spears, but most have only a rock or a sharpened stick. We seek arms to defend ourselves, a gnome declares loudly. Hand over some of your equipment and we'll release you. We can even pay you something. I'll give you some food for a helmet, one of the small folk exclaims. No, give me some armor and I'll give you a health potion, chimes in another. The gnomes all loudly shout their own offers, trying to drown each other out. Yeah, we got some shit we can give you. Uh, which is better of these? Can I... This is a 15 damage, which is just good against northmen, northerners, okay. And this one has 18 damage that's really good against northerners. Okay, yeah. I like how my swords are made for ethnic cleansing. These are only good against nor northerners. Neat. You surrender the equipment to the gnomes. Satisfied, they offer payment in return. Oh, there we go. Okay. We don't actually need this much money. I think we've already done the part of this that needs money. We would have preferred the food. Gnomes retreat to the for forest with their prize and soon begin fighting over it. You gain two fame. What do we need? Fifteen? Yeah, let's go down. Children. Lost boy. <laughs> it's hard to conceive that either of us were ever such. Shilling this game for the Aussies? They're, you know the odds you aren't going to shell out money for this. Come on. A deeper voice growls. We have to take him to the dungeons or else he'll run straight to whatever northern clan he spawned from and show them where our outpost is. That's a shifty look- Oh, that's a shifty looking kid. I wouldn't trust him as far as I could throw him, says Malaclips. You consider the boy's fate. Save him or offer to take the boy to the dungeon. Eh, we'll save him. Unsheathing your weapon, you demand they let the boy go. Musketeers... Okay, the Empire soldiers are unmoved by your threat. Maybe we shouldn't be picking fights with like less than half health, but uh, we gotta good, do a good deed. We need some fame, so that I think that requires sticking our neck out a little bit. Watchmen, taken from the dregs of society, elevated to petty positions of power. Watchmen can block, greatly reducing incoming damage. Use bash to open them up for damage. Once again, good intentions end up with people trying to hit me. Ah. Uh, we actually have more health than I thought. This isn't so bad. Yeah, give me a shield. Nice, nice. Shit, you get hit, you lose your special attack. DSP jokes. I can see it coming. They might already be in chat, but I haven't looked. There it is. He does it for free. It's even better. That's better than DSP jokes. I like this, though. Like, I thought this game was going to be easy. That was my main concern here. Just press the parry button. Yeah. Well, you do have to time it somewhat, but, yeah. As you check on the unconscious guards, you notice the boy looking at you warily as if sizing you up. But, yeah, I was afraid this game was going to be too easy, so I'm, I'm enjoying the fact that I'm doing a little shit at it. Oh, yeah, good. Yeah, just a, a terrible roll. Um, if we kept the six, we would need a another six would still not be enough. Yeah, if we 
got the three, we would need... We could do that. Let's do that. We'll keep it three. Nope, nope. Fuck. Wrong. Okay, we fucked it up. <laughs> okay. We could do this. Didn't do it. Nope. Oh, no, wait. We could. I was reading the wrong one. Yeah, we fucked that up in a lot of ways. I was reading the seven as the one we needed. Yeah, okay. I'm just... That's just bad. The boy disappears into the forest, and soon you hear him howl from a short distance. The raiders come out of hiding, and the boy shouts, Their outpost is that way! Stop the raiders, allow the raiders to attack. Maybe we could get something out of them, just let them do it. Nope, nothing. Nope, I'm just a big coward. Just let them kill them. Okay. The market bazaar is a hive of activity. Traders from across... Oh, is this where I get robbed from again? Yep. Okay, that's fine. Apparently there's something I can get from here if I catch this. This thief. Okay, this one. Yes! Okay, you can track it, it looks like. Like, I track- like, I actually, you know, watched the card move, and it seemed like it was actually pretty easy to track. The thief is nimble, but you managed to gain on him. Right, now we actually gotta get a good roll. Nine. Okay, so if we- Yeah, we gotta re-roll re both these, I think. Keep the five. Come on, sixes! Nope, even worse. Okay, RNG, thank you. You got away. Are we starving? We're starving again. The wilds are welcoming. Their bounty plentiful. You feel soothed and reinvigorated by your exploration. Oh, just what we needed. Except, not really. What we really needed was food. But... These are the choices that make the hero. Or the villain. Hmm. The town crier announces the Empire seeks mercenaries to join the battle against corruption. You seek out the watchtower where recruitment is taking place. You arrive in time to hear Sir Mallet Fowl's plan to wipe out the Poppers District. The outbreak began there, and we cannot risk sparing any of their lives, he says. Sir Malifowl the Green leads the mercenaries to the Popper District, where the poor and sick have been walled off from the rest of the city. As you hear the wailing of corrupted, Sir Malifowl gives his command a charge. Fight the corrupted or refuse to kill the paupers. But aren't they corrupted? Is there a moral ambiguity that I'm missing here? Or is it just, I mean, they're... Why would I refuse? They're, they're bad now, right? Right? They've degenerated. Kill them. Just, just kill them. I don't see the problem. Like, can you turn them back? I haven't heard anything like that. No reason to believe that. So, give me a, uh, give me a, give me a shield. Thank you. Gotta remember to do that. Okay, having these allies is pretty sweet. You can just kind of let them get in the way of some of the enemies and just sort of focus on one at a time. Not that they do much, but they get in the way. Ooh. Nice. See, that guy didn't have he didn't have a color thing that time. Also, wow. They get easier every time I do it. Which I guess is what you would expect, but. Sir Malifal commends you for your bravery and offers you a reward. Uh, food, please. Food? Could you pay me in food? Um, let's let's get to this guy here. Yeah, One more go. relic is within your grasp. Who hired these thieves? That is the true question. Though their movements are erratic, you eventually track the thieves back to their camp. You catch them frantically loading the relic onto a horse and cart. Just hold them off for a couple of minutes while we ready the horses. Thieves evade heavy weapons more frequently. Okay, well, let's go to something else then. Uh, also, did we lose our good axe? Or we were using this? Oh, yeah, that's kind of shitty. Let's use, uh... These are thieves, so let's use cutthroat blades. Those are supposed to be good against thieves. Yeah. yeah. Actually making good decisions for once. Do this at random. Sometimes it does this, sometimes it doesn't. Also, what the fuck is wrong with my arm? 
Lovely pair of fine blades, fit for the finest gentleman. Well sharpened, well cared for, and deadly. Shield. Hate it when you're oh 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 I threw my good axe to the plant. Yeah right yeah right combat solves so little it has ended this however I think we might have fucked up a little bit by going to this guy first. He was like the third option out of the three, probably the last one we're supposed to go to, but also that was just shit on my part. Like I'm embarrassed, that was bad. Let's go to the high priestess. She's the first one on the list. Let's also like... Oh, but wait. No, this is a problem. You see this? You see the three things that we need for this and we have none of them? Oh, wait a minute. Yeah, never mind. Let's, uh, what about... Empress? None of those either. Okay, well, it, it actually seems like the one we went to is the one we want to go to. We just want to fucking do better. Maybe prepare a little better. Yeah, like, are any of these that don't give me shit? Yeah, like, I don't need this. Get that away. I, uh, I don't need this. Yeah, let's get some ones with food. 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 There we go, that'll help. She can also give food. For some reason, it doesn't show up there as a thing you can do. Also, this one, too. Wait a minute. Okay. Uh, gain max life. I don't, don't need that. Food, though. 10 out of 10. Yes, thank you. Uh, those are all good. Gain resources is good. Token we need. Food, food. Map, food. Okay, this is good. This is much better. I think this is an improvement. Should be able to do this. Just need to, just need to be a little smarter, a little more on our toes, a little fucking better at the combat, not being so ass at it. And then we'll be fine. But this is like this is making me like the this game the a lot more. A leader, to be an exemplar for the world. As your heart goes, the body follows. Are his voice lines like semi-random? Because he didn't say that last time. I'm assuming all this shit is the same, right? I'm gonna ask just in case it does anything. If you don't ask, I, you know. But yeah, I don't think any of this matters. Really. Thanks for the swords. Yep. They are as sharp as your wit, I fear. <laughs> Thanks. Find the four relic. Okay. Um, let's go kill these guys first while we have lots of health. I mean, it's not going to get any... We have the same weapons we were using before. Also, wow, already? Isn't this the guy you got to pay ten coin? Yeah, I don't have that. Oh, I do! No, I do! Okay, give it to him. Require a test of skill. Right. Eat the right flower. Okay, a daisy. Daisy tastes like wilted lettuce with a hint of something like bitter medicine. Oh, daisies are also not good. But less not good? There we go. About fucking time we get some rolls that go our way. To your horror, blood begins to blossom under your shirt. You wonder how you pull it up to see if it is merely a superficial cut, but you wonder how it occurred nonetheless. Oh, okay. Merc nods, happy with the results. He beckons Malaclips closer. Of those of us left, you should seek Ira of the Vale. She may know something of the cure. Last I heard, she's hiding out in the underneath. Let us discover what the next chapter in our dear Bard's tale will oh, be. Go. Oh no, not her. Malaclip straightens his back shawl nervously. The greasy goblin man giggles maniacally. Yes, her. She'll like. Let me give this a proper goblin voice. She'll likely eat your bones before <laughs> like fuck, but she'll likely eat your bones before she lets you speak. Now if you'll excuse me, I have business to run. With that, Malcolm's associate turns away and hurls a bouquet into a shock pa at a shock power passerby. Flowers! Fresh flowers! Buy them or I'll eat your eyes. To fame. Okay, good, this is a start. How is streaming going with my new PC? You tell me, buddy. Does it look good? I'm I'm I am, uh, streaming at, like, double the bitrate that I was before, so 
and like there's no lag at all hard to compare because I didn't dream this game before but yeah it's going pretty fucking well the wilds are sometimes treacherous and harmful I eat some poison berries because I never learn doesn't even give me food either I mean I guess because I probably vomit them up or something but I can eat more berries eat more berries fucking right after one after another and now we're starving don't tell me I'm gonna eat more berries Okay, no, I just fall over and lose all my food, but I don't have any food, so no problem. Yeah, let's, let's come and kill this guy. Quick. Starvation has been the end of many adventurers. Eat more berries. So this is the Dark Souls of something. I hate that. <laughs> I know it's like like everybody fucking hates it. It's like a meme now, but the fucking Dark Souls of it 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 grates me. The thieves' erratic motions, movement crosses right into your path. Yeah, yeah, we got this. We did this. Let's go. This is the Dark Souls of card games. The problem with this timing that fucks me up a lot is sometimes you get locked into an attack and so you can press block but you won't cancel out of your attack quick enough. So like you need to not just be mashing the buttons for attack, you need to like time it well. But that's especially hard with these knives when like they don't do a lot of damage so you want to be like spamming them. I don't know. Oh the thieves escaped soon. Oh okay. Well we're not... Wait what is that? Okay yeah we're not gonna kill them in that amount of time. Oh, oh. The Dark Souls of Berries. The distant sounds of horses alert you to a carriage disappearing over the horizon. You'll never catch them now. The relic escapes in the wild. What do you mean we'll never catch them? They're right there. Doesn't seem so bad. Okay, we need to fucking camp. Oh, we're dead. We're dead. Right? still our best weapon. Although, give me, give me, give me a shield. Because these are northerners, right? What are these? Trappers and sk skulls? Five, tra ooh. One-handed weapons. Okay, yeah, yeah, we'll use that. Pretty fucking low on health, though. I can't die again. It's like it's been like two minutes. So five of skulls and trappers, does that mean it's five trappers? Is that what I'm... No, it's got, no, it's actually skulls. Okay. Return. Raised from endless sleep to fight once more. Skeletons are weak, but come armed with an assortment of equipment, making preparations for combat challenging. Vulnerable to holy. Thanks for the shield. Oh, they are weak. Okay. Ah! Okay, this is bad. Okay. Uh, no! Give me, give me shield. Give me shield. Please. He's not gonna give me shield. Is it only once per battle? Get out. Give me shield. Yes, thank you. Thank you. Whew. Okay, we got it. We got it. There it is. Whew. I think that was no damage. No, we got hit towards the beginning. Okay, yeah, this is almost no damage. Give me some food, some health, both. Equipment. I don't need equipment. Soldier sword. Oh, it's, it's better. Yeah, thanks, I guess, but it's not really what I need. Food, thank you. Yes, okay. Um, Camp. Those who are desperate can never hope to get the best possible price. What? <laughs> Was, what? After another long day in the wilds, you find a peaceful spot to make camp. Food for sale has refreshed. Equipment for sale. Oh, there's stuff for sale. A sweating trader comes jogging in from the darkness wilds to the darkening wilds to join your campfire. Thank God you're here. I don't know how to start a fire. It's my first time traveling to the capital. The bard attempts and fails to set up a camp. Be perfectly honest, I'm not sure why you would bring me along on this adventure. 
handling precious relics and such. You just keep me around for my dashing looks, don't you? Cook food for five health. Let's start. And I can buy food. I don't have much money. Right. Yep. This is, uh, buy food, I guess. Oh, okay. Let's, uh, do I want to sell one of these? Sell the, sell the soldier's sword. I mean, we need food. You know, it's, it'd be nice to have, but if we're dead, we're dead. Right? Okay. Uh, we're good trading. Now, cook food. Cook food. Cook food. Cook food. The problem here is that one food heals five... It heals five life, but if you don't have food, you lose ten life for every turn you don't have food. So, like, there's definitely a trade-off here. Like, I guess I'll keep two, even though it's really shitty. I want to fight these guys, but the thing is, like, we cannot take... I don't think we can take them with 31 health. Especially since we had to go, like, all out and try and, like, beat them fast. Which is going to be hard to do if we're also trying to be defensive. So I think let's hope for the best here. Okay, well, that was not a good idea, I guess. Yep. Yeah, that wasn't the same. All right. Maybe grind the lower levels, too. Yeah. Maybe. Like I said, though, I'm fucking... Pleased as punch that this game is actually somewhat challenging. Ah. Give me shield, can you? Nope. No shield. I guess it reached. Oh, I'm. Oh, that's not my guy. <laughs> Fuck, wrong guy. Yeah, duh, I didn't see the electric guitar in his back. Ooh, ooh. Okay, got the shield, used it immediately. Nice, okay. Now just the anarchists. Okay, not bad, not bad. Sometimes you just get bad cards, restart the thing. I think we're fine, because the thing is, I think you get the same... Like, I think they're basically the same cards, but they're just in different orders. So, like, I think we've gone through most of the really bad ones. And also, I think I'm getting better at this combat. I'm taking less and less damage. Oh, and we got... Okay, okay. Cardinal Shield has that special attack, right? Bash causes additional to armor. Or this shield, which reduces movement speed. Def I don't really like reduced movement speed. Let's go with the sword. A remnant of the Templars and, and their religious righteousness. Okay, and more food. Yeah, we're good. We're good. Um, in fact, can we just camp, like, any fucking time we want? Yeah, let's just heal some more. Okay, this- No, we're fine, we're fine. We can do this. Uh... I wanna give this a shot. Let's give this a shot. I mean, we didn't take that much damage last time. Oh, it said... Should change the knives. It's fine. We'll make do. I don't like the knives that much anyway. I don't know, they don't feel quite right. <laughs> Cardinal Blade, prepared for violence in every direction. Oh wait, wait, wait. Give me the shield first. I know I'm wasting time, but this is important. Also, this sword is gonna be perfect if I could get a good, like, special attack right in the middle. There, 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 there. Okay. Ah, uh, I keep attacking like right before they attack. It fucks me up. Yeah, 
we're about to like fuck that loose. Mm, okay. Okay. Different. Uh, this is the point where we do a different one. <laughs> For sure. Now death comes to you. I'm hoping it is just that I've taken off more. Like I've bitten off more than I can chew here. For oh, we actually got this though. Oh, just a new part of the quest for not this time. 